Hey, what's going on guys? Valiant Blaze here with Soul Purpose Gaming and I just want to bring you a quick informal video of how to use the last word properly or how I use it anyways. Um, I get I do really 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 well with the last word and it's my go-to weapon for when I want to go sweaty and um, yeah let me go ahead and tell you guys what I do. First and foremost the style of using the last word. Some people like to go offensive with it. Me personally I like to go defensive. I like to play defensive with uh, all my weapons mostly just because I find it way easier to attack somebody who's coming at you in a straight line. If you guys know anything about boxing you know it's a lot easier to hit somebody when they're coming after you than it is when they're moving away. So um, I like to bait people. The way I bait people is I'll go ahead and tap them real quick around the corner or maybe I'll like you know spray them real quick. I'll go behind the corner reload my weapon and by that time they've already closed in the gap for me and come around the corner to try to finish me off. A lot of times I'll throw a grenade right before they hit the corner and I'm, a lot of, I'm able to uh, chip off a bit of their health before they even make it there. And uh, that brings me to my next issue. The only problem with the last word really isn't even really the range. The range is actually pretty decent on it. It's really just that reload. You have a uh, really, really small magazine. The way I uh, deal with the magazine is there's a couple of different ways. You can either have a really good grenade um, that's uh, really reliable and you can use in close ranges because a lot of times you're going to have to use that grenade in close ranges. All right? Or you're going to have to be really, really good with the um, throwing knife. Or the last one is you just switch your weapon. You either have a sidearm or a shotgun or something like that or a sniper rifle. A uh, sniper rifle is probably the hardest one to do as far as a secondary if you're going to use it as finish just because you have to be super accurate with it. All you, usually all you have to do is him in the body but even then whatever could be a challenge to some people. Um, but if you choose to use something else other than a sniper rifle realize you're going to have to do a lot of baiting and you're not going to be able to uh, you know, help your team out if the battle ends up being a long range battle. You're going to have to find a way to bait, or you're going to have to close in the gap with some kind of uh, blink jump or, you know, some kind of roly poly oly type crap. Um, <laughs> it can be pretty tough to close in the gap sometimes, especially against a good team that um, is, they, they know where they're at and they're waiting for you to come to them. Uh, a lot of people do play the last word offensive. The only problem with that is that when you, you're, you only have enough bullets to finish off one guy. So if you're playing offensive and you're jumping in the mix, like realize you're going to finish off one guy and then you're going to die. Finish off one guy and then die because you have to reload. So, um, you know, that's why I play defensive. Uh, as far as zooming in, hard aim and stuff and shooting from the hip, some people say, oh, you always shoot from the hip. And some people say, no, you got a hard aim. Me personally, I usually hard aim. You might see me in this clip, whatever, uh, you know, uh, it just fire from the hip a couple times. The reason I'm doing that, though, usually is because I have a couple bullets to spare the guy's almost dead and on top of that like you know the guy's either moving in a straight line or it, something's going on where he's really really easy to hit he's either really up in my face you know melee range or something and he's just making it really stupid easy for me and I'm just trying to work around the guy either get behind him or jump over him or something like that so we're in you're just in such close distance that's not even worth hard aiming in and that's pretty much it guys um those are all the tips i've got for you today i hope you guys enjoy the video and it, you take something from it and if you do go ahead and smack the like button and i'll see you guys in the next video